Hey guys, welcome to our YouTube channel. Today we are going to solve our skill track daily challenge using Python programming language. Before going to logic, if you didn't subscribe to our channel, then subscribe right now and make our work more meaningful. First, we'll understand our question. The program has to accept the string yes as the input and print the characters from the last but one occurrence of the last character till the end of the string and if the last character occurs only once then the program must print minus one as the output suppose we are going to accept the string yes and then print the characters from the last but one occurrence of the last character till the end of the string and if the last character occurs only once then we have to print minus one We'll take our first test case. So in this string yes, the last character is A. So now we have to find where the next A occurs from the last. That is, we have to print the characters from the last but the first occurrence of the last character. So that is from A to A, that is A in A will be our output. So we'll take our another test case. So in this test case, the last character is K and the next K from the last occurs here. So we'll print from here to here as the output. And then we'll take our another test case. So here the last character is R, which occurs only once. So we must print minus one as the output. This minus one will be our output. Now let us implement our program. First we'll get our input the string yes and then we'll have a variable called start index equal to minus one which represents the index of the the first occurrence of the last character from the last so for index in range len of yes minus two comma minus one comma minus one so this will represent that is from the last and if the s of index is equal to equal to yes of minus one so then the start index will be equal to the index and we'll use break that is if the last character is occurred another time means we use break and then if the start index equal to equal to minus one that is if it occurs only once then we are going to print minus one and in the else part we'll print the s of start index column that is it will print from the start index to the last character so let us run our program yes we have got the correct output 
Now we'll pass our another test case. Here also we have got the correct output. That is last character is K. So from K to K we have got the output. Now we'll pass our another test case. And here we have got minus one as the output as the last character occurs only once. Our program has passed all our given test cases successfully. Hope you guys understand. Thanks for watching. See you next video.